peace, family. This is your boy, Tiger Toledo. I just wanted to share something quick with you guys. So one of the things that I like to do in my notary agency is create flyers, business cards, brochures, stuff like that. So one of the companies that I use is called Kessler. Now, I want to show you a trick, a really good hack that's going to save you a lot of money here. So many companies like Kessler, which is a digital printing uh, place, right? What they like to do is when they know that it's a direct mailer like this, they know that there's money involved. Only companies that have money really get direct mailers, but I'm going to show you a hack on how to do this, okay? So normally you'll you just select the size. You really don't need a big size. Um, on this one, I believe this, this is actually the smallest size that they have, six and a half by nine, right? Um, quantity, I just want to do a thousand. Uh, paper, yeah, that's the only one that they offer on, on this platform. Um, side, I want to do double-sided, right? So not single, but I want to hit double. And then now you guys can get the high gloss UV. I personally don't do the gloss. I do the no high gloss. I just want to show you what some of these uh, direct mailers look like. Okay. So you guys receive them in the mail all the time from Burlington Coat Factory to casinos to every company it's effective at the end of the day it's effective one of the things you want to do you might want to throw in a ten dollar coupon but it's it's something tangible for your customers to touch again and remind them that they have done business with you you would like to either get some feedback or possibly get a referral so you can do all kind of different stuff here when you're reaching out to the clients right they go to other mail outs right here now if, of course if you want to do this you'll put your stamp or you can go with a direct mailing place but otherwise you can hand write the address yourself and then mail them out so these are really really good ways of staying in touch with your clients but i'm going to show you a really good hack right i'm going to show you a really good hack as you see like even politicians do these things so you can really make these look good, really, really make these look good. But here's what I wanted to show you. So with the direct mailer, as you guys can see, look at the price on that thing, right? For just a thousand. Now, a lot of you guys know I come from a, um, a marketing background. I have a sales and marketing background. So I know the tricks of the trade on this thing. So they want to charge $260 for a thousand flyers, which is um six and a half by nine double-sided no high gloss right so i want to show you this what you want to do is not go with direct mailer because they know that you got some money and they're trying to dip into your pocket so what you want to do is go to flyers okay same concept it's the same exact thing you guys so what you want to do here you're going to select a four by six. That's the perfect ideal size for a flyer. Perfect size. Um, then the qu quantity, you want to pick a thousand side. We're going to keep everything the same, double sided. Uh, coding, no, we don't want to do the high gloss. Do you want preparation? Like if you had tickets and stuff, right? And people can like, you know, break it off. Eh, no, we don't need none of that. And then do we need them to score it? No no score so check out the price difference y'all this one is 260 dollars this one is 90 dollars you see that you see the big price difference that you're able to do it's just a i just wanted to share this small hack with you guys if you wanted to get into more of a like not just having a business card but actually having a a nice little hand flyer brochure right like if you're at a client's house and they say, hey, do you have a business card? Imagine giving them a business card and you give them this flyer that they can actually put on their refrigerator. And then you put something real nice, like maybe a family or, you know, some type of 
cool design that you designed on Canva. I'll show you on our Canva. We, we, we have some really good designs um, that we create, especially like for a power of attorney, right? Give me a second here to pull this up so you can kind of see here what I mean. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Okay, here it comes. As you can see, we design a lot of stuff. We do a lot of designing. Um, we're actually opening up our design team for other notaries out there, other notary professional business owners. So if that's something that you would like us to help you out with and create some really, really good designs for maybe a brochure or business cards, um, reach out to support at usnotaryagency.com. That's support at usnotaryagency.com. So let's just say we did something like this, right? Like this flyer right here for our agency. We would make it in the dimensions that we want a four and a half by, you know, four and a half by six. Um, and then it will have something like power of attorney. Um, and then maybe a coupon and then it has our logo and it says why it, let's, let's zoom into it a little bit more. Why it's better to discuss this sooner rather than later, right? And then if I was gonna make this into like a flyer or brochure, on the side, I'll put a phone number, get in contact with us today, website, phone number, and so on and so forth. So you guys can see how that would work. Um, and then this is something that they can actually put on their refrigerator. Sometimes they put have it in their car, in their glove compartment, their armrest. There's so many um, reasons why a client would keep this flyer. So I hope this helps out, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I wish you guys the best. Happy cash flow and steady stamping, baby. You're